Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer software testing interview question 226. That is, how many times do we have to perform regression testing in a project? Let me answer. So if you get this kind of question in the interviews, okay? So the question states that how many times do we have to perform regression testing in the project? How many times guys? Do we have to perform regression testing for every build we receive from the developers okay we have to perform regression testing right so the moment the developers send you a build for testing we have to perform regression testing okay because every build has some code changes you see build one build version one it is given to you okay you completed regression testing and cycle testing cycle is completed then you reported some defects or whatever it is. Then developers uh, keep on working on adding new functionalities or modifying the existing functionalities, removing or fixing the defects. They do some code changes and they give you another version of the build. Again, because of these code changes done by the developers, there is a possibility that existing working functionalities can be introduced with some side effects, okay? So because of the code changes happened in one of the areas of the application, the other areas which were working earlier in the previous build may not work for us now. So that's the reason every time we receive a build, that means some code changes developer has done from the previous build to the current build. Since the code changes happened, we are not sure which area of the application got side effect, okay? So to check that we have to perform regression testing every Every time we receive a build, we have to perform regression testing on that new build, okay? So what is the answer for this question? How many times? The number of times we received the build from the developers, that many number of times we have to perform regression testing in the project, okay? So if the developers have sent you the build 10 times, you have to perform regression testing 10 times like that okay for every build we have to perform regression testing guys. okay the answer is the number of times the developers will send you the build for testing a new build or kind of build for testing that many number of times you have to perform regression testing okay it's not one two three the answer is not like that guys it depends on the number of times we receive the build from the developers so hope guys you got the answer for this question so that's all for this session in the next session i'm going to answer another software testing interview question for you Till then, see you. Bye-bye.